Well, a split among Missouri Republicans could send the state into a financial catastrophe if a deal isn't struck in the state Senate. We told you earlier this month about the federal reimbursement allowance, which lets Missouri get reimbursed by the federal government for Medicaid payments. Missouri Capitol Bureau Chief Joe McLean has new reporting from Jefferson City that critical measure could be in jeopardy. Both Republicans and Democrats say this is a must-pass bill, or else the state will forego more than $4 billion. That's roughly one-tenth of the state's entire budget. Last time, it took a special session to renew this program, and comments from some Republicans in the Senate signal that may happen again. You can't, you can't jeopardize $4.5 billion. Um. On Thursday, Republican Senate Leader Caleb Rowden said he's certain state lawmakers will come to a deal on renewing the FRA. The moral of the story we saw two years ago gets done one way or the other. So, The last time the program was up for renewal in 2021, Senate infighting held up the bill as a faction of Republicans demanded that it include a ban on state money for abortions, which is already part of state law, and a prohibition on any reimbursement for Planned Parenthood. It forced lawmakers to come back that summer for a special session and eventually pass the FRA without those changes. Now, though, the same group of GOP senators formed a new caucus and said they'll be holding out for those same amendments again. Yeah. It should be, from what I hear from our, our other uh, component in, in the House, uh, that, that hopefully will be sent over to the Senate with that already attached. Renewal of the FRA is set to be heard in a committee on Wednesday and will likely be approved after that, according to Rowden, if, that is, lawmakers are able to agree on its content. In Jefferson City, Joe McLean, WGEM News.